right now on the 5 o'clock news. Opening arguments begin in the trial of two men charged with the murder of hip hop icon and run DMC member Jam Master J more than 20 years after his death. In less than 24 hours, the New York City Council expected to hold a vote on overriding the mayor's veto of the controversial How Many Stops Act as many lawmakers continued to voice their support for the legislation. And two Queens brothers charged with 130 counts of criminal possession of a weapon after police found an arsenal of ghost guns and explosives inside their apartment in Astoria. Good evening, I'm Natasha Verma. And I'm Steve Lacey. Welcome to the 5 o'clock news. The Queens DA, DA announcing that massive bust today. And aside from the cache of firearms and explosives, authorities say they also uncovered a handwritten hit list targeting law enforcement, celebrities, and others. Ashley Rodriguez is live in a story outside the apartment building where that raid took place. And Ashley, with that hit list, a very situation, a very scary situation that's unfolding. Oh, absolutely. And the DA says what was inside this apartment behind me could have led to a catastrophe. You're watching the five o'clock news. How would you like to buy a home for just a dollar? If it sounds too good to be true, think again. All right, today a special lottery took place in Newark, giving some lucky folks a chance to scoop up residential properties for beyond bargain prices. Teresa Priola walks us through the details. With the crank of a handle, four Newarkers became homeowners. The realization of a lifelong dream found buried at the bottom of a raffle basket. It's absolutely amazing. It's unbelievable. This is, true. This is truly a blessing. Um...